Assalamu alaikum lovely people welcome back to my channel if you're new here thank you so so much for clicking and please if you haven't subscribed yet please consider by smashing that button and be part of the family so in today's video I am here to react to my video that I posted talking about that guy that the agent like doing something like scam scam tell you that i posted okay so i am here to react to some comments and some messages that i got from my facebook page masha allah that means i am putting some impact in people's life is the english correct guys don't mind me the other day i was cooking and hot water split on my face and like i forgot i used my hand to wipe it like this because the way now i say shame you know i'm gonna piercing in the how run to the non Ghanaian speakers, I'm sorry. Like it's it's hot water that bent my my abogeseno. <laughs> so that is not the reason why I am here. Let me go to the video. So yeah, let me read some comment from here, guys. Like Masha Allah, Masha Allah. As I already mentioned, meaning I am putting some impact in some people's life about this traveling process. And disclaimer i am not an agent and these videos that i am making or any video that i posted about traveling process or traveling issues please i am just here to guide people yeah so i'm not agent i don't do visa for, for anyone i don't know much about visa issues but just that what is happening that sometimes I just want to talk something small and direct some people how to go about it or what to do so yeah so these are some of the messages that i am getting from my facebook page and like masha allah it is making my head big like this guys masha allah it always motivates me it will always ginger me to do more like even if i am not feeling to make any video reading this comment alone gives me some strength to do another video so i really appreciate you all although i'm not getting enough views but guys i'm not giving up i'm like i will keep on pushing yeah a day will come like what i am looking for i will get it so this message i get it from my, uh, my facebook page this person alima to Saadia, i like your videos and i have intention to come to kuwait please okay and okay that person continues soon i will be joining you over there by the power of god have learned so much about kuwait from you masha allah and this person too said hi good day halima i really like your channel so educating masha allah thank you so so much okay so these are the comments i think i did not screenshot it all yeah so let me go into the video that i posted some comments okay let me react to this comment okay so all of you i know that many people have been watching my video but they don't comment yeah so shout out to everybody those who share my videos, comment, watch, I really appreciate you all. And please, if you share my video without seeing me saying thank you, please not intentional because sometimes, <laughs> very busy. Even to reply comment sometimes, guys, it's not easy. You know, we are in Ramadan time. And I know, I know that like everybody's busy, but you know, in Gulf country here, you know how it is, okay? So this comment is from Justin Vibes. She said, very insightful video. Most agents are terrible. Terrible agents should finish everything for one before payment. A friend of mine was scammed by one, one agent last year. 300000 is huge money. Oh, Alima, I love this video. Okay, Sister Josephine, thank you. You see, so that means it has been happening to some people too. It is very sad. And Salito Salina too said, I was almost into this trap when someone asked me for 150,000 Kenyan shillings just for visa, no work yet. We should be more grateful, careful. Okay, so you see, it's not easy. And Sister Deborah Kabasa, home living she said i feel so sad that they work they work so hard to put that money together for some person called a traveling agent to scam him out of the, his money i am so sorry to say he is never going to get the money back or the visa imagine how many other people that travel agency have done the same thing to other people <clears throat> sis you are right you are right if this guy didn't like uh, like uh, go to the agent i don't think he is going to get this uh, money even let me say something small before i continue reading my comments guys 
you know if you want to travel eh, the best way is to travel with company okay company agency like for those people you know they have registered so they cannot run with your money and we have some people those those on the road side say they are also agent all those some of them are genuine some of them too if you joke they are going to run with your money okay so be careful out there and as i was saying talking about the visa okay sometimes visa to it do delay okay when some agents start to do the process sometimes the visa delay but not up to five months yeah <laughs> not up to five months but this guy only said four months five months five four to five months now he never got his visa so in my order sometimes visa do delays but not to that extent okay so let me continue reading the comments you guys are so so amazing and i know that many of us we are all learning yeah and it's not even widows coming to gulf countries here alone yeah it is well hmm. so this person said the name is goodness daniel okay he commented please sister i want to come and work in kuwait i need agent there is one that i met online he said there is cleaner job that it will cost me the sum of 1.8 million naira but i should hold the money till the visa comes out and i get to confirm it what do you think okay my brother yeah, I think you are uh, you are a guy. I can't tell you, but Daniel is a guy's name, right? So my brother, for this then, uh, hmm, online agent. In fact, hmm, this, some something like this. Sometimes I don't want to talk much. Okay, I don't want to talk much. For me, I will say like you have to look for an agent from your area where you have seen that this agent has been doing for people to travel or traveling aid like company okay that is the best way this person that you said you have met him online and he will he want to do some uh, visa for you do you know something let me say something here for all of us to understand something okay now we have quality agent that if uh, any company want people they'll go to the agent okay so for example i'm in kuwait here and maybe that agent who i know him okay and the agent will be like halima i need people Okay, I am the second person, right? And then I will also call someone in Ghana and said, hey, maybe whom should I use it from Ghana? <laughs> and like I, will, like, I will also get someone from Ghana and I'll be like, okay, hi, dear, like, uh, I need people in Kuwait here. I will never even say that this is, we have agent here. I will be, I will, uh, like, I will do myself like I am the agent. Okay, and the one who want to travel to come here, for the uh, Kuwaiti agent, for him, the person who told me to look for people for him, like, the company will pay him. So me, that will also talk to the one in Ghana. Okay, I will need something. The person, the third person too will need something. So the person who is doing the process, he have to pay all of us. Yes, because I will need my share. And, like, the person in Ghana too will need his, his or her share. You see, so sometimes it is not easy. Although, if you have the money and you get a genuine agent, go ahead and do it because sometimes it is not easy to look for work for someone to come here okay but sometimes be careful be careful and sometimes the visa to in fact me halima here i cannot identify fake and original uh, visa so be careful this is what people have been using to scam people although they will say they will do the visa for you although they will do the visa for you but it is not original it will be fake okay fake visa so be careful out there Open your eyes, please. I don't want to spoil any one market. I'm not spoiling any one market, but we should be truth, truthful because we know how hard the world is turning into right now. So we shouldn't sit somewhere to scam people and collect their money to chop. You know, I have been here for some years now, so I can do that and maybe I'll be like, oh, I can help you to come and then I'll collect someone money to eat. Much like, astaghfirullah, it is haram. It is not good. Tell the truth so that the like the person who is doing the process after everything went well for him or her, the person will know what to do next. Yes. The person can say, Oh, this agent really helped me out. So I'm going to 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 to, to help him too or something like that, or look for something for him. So let me read this comment from this my sister. She said, Alima to God bless the day I join your channel. I join your channel on this YouTube. Remember you saved my ass in January this year. I would have been the one going to met on the street now. 
This guy tried dumping me $1,500 for Kuwait white visa. They were on my head to take a snappy decision since the other syndicate is based in Kuwait, as they all claimed. You see, yeah, so we have the main Kuwaiti agent and like, for example, maybe I am like, maybe the Kuwaiti agent asked me or maybe I want to work with him. So, you see, that was the second person. Okay. Like, I don't need to even read the whole thing. So, I will put it on the screen for all of us to, to read. So, I really love this testimonial. So, let me read the end. She said, guess what? I tried verifying the visa they sent me. It was invalid or true. I sent to few persons to help verify. They said it is fake. You see, as I was saying, because it is not easy for you to identify the fake and the original uh, visa. If you haven't traveled before if or if you are not an agent, you will never know. Me, I will never know. So I reach out to you on IG. You advise amicably. I oblige and it worked for me. They wouldn't let me rest with messaging. I should pay them even $500. Every day it is moving from one story to the other. I didn't send them the money. I focus on mourning my mom. We are all in at peace within ourselves now. No money lost. That is my greatest joy. God bless you. Alimatuma, Allah. Oh, I love this testimony. My sister, thank you so, so much for also listening to me. You know, maybe some people watch and they will be like, oh, what is this girl saying? As I already mentioned, guys, I am not an agent. I am not a, like a traveling advisor or something like that. But the little that I know that I always put it out here for all of us to uh, listen and maybe learn. Okay. The other time someone asked me, okay, like I have been saying sometimes in my videos that coming here you spend a lot. Why did I come here? Okay, maybe this person is new person. You didn't know the time that I come I came to Kuwait here. So my next video, I am going to say the reason why I am still in Kuwait here. And when I like what time or what year I came to Kuwait here. So for that one, I think you guys will understand me more. So I don't want this video to be too much long. So this is what I just want to share with you guys. The compliment, the testimonial, the comment. Masha Allah. God bless you all. I really appreciate. And please, after watching, give me thumbs up. Some people don't like giving thumbs up. I don't know why. So please give the video thumbs up. Watch it to an end. Just support me. Okay, support me. Support me. We are growing small, small. See you in my next video. Masala.